by PETA to stop the trucks. Tonight, there is a push by this animal rights group to stop those horse-drawn carriage rides in Old Sacramento. Let's go to Tony Lopez Live now with what this is all about, Tony. Well, it was a crash that happened right here at 3rd and O in downtown Sacramento late last month. It shook up the poor people on board, the poor horse got spooked, and now a national animal rights group is also stirring up controversy, but the city of Sacramento is telling PETA to hold their horses. Without the horses in Old Sacramento, and that clippity clop on the street, it just wouldn't be the same. It wouldn't be Old Sacramento. It's a divine equine experience. Tourists count on to take them back in time. It's nearly always a peaceful prance. Late last month, it was a near disaster. An alleged drunk driver slammed into the back of a horse-drawn carriage in downtown Sacramento. The passengers and operator went flying. The horse ran wild, dragging half the carriage with him. Everyone survived, but the crash got Peter's pulse pounding. And now it's saddling up, demanding the carriages ride off into the sunset. Horse-drawn carriages and city traffic are a dangerous combination, PETA's director writes Mayor Kevin Johnson. The city was quick to point out one important fact. This is the first incident that we've had in 10 years. That's scary. We dusted off video of that very incident, and here it is, complete with sound from the driver whose car was actually hit by a spooked horse. He ran to the end of the block in a panic. Tonight, the city isn't panicking over just two incidents in 10 years pointing to its 20-year-old horse-drawn carriage ordinance it calls one of the strictest in the nation. They have to have insurance. You have to go through an annual driving permit. Um, and we take it seriously. Now, Peter has been successful in influencing other cities to ban horse-drawn carriage rides. Las Vegas and Key West, Florida come to mind. But two accidents in a decade, certainly not enough in the city of Sacramento to listen to Peter this time. You see him in Manhattan. I mean, you know, there's well, yeah. animals all over the place. Yeah, there are horses yeah. it, it is church. a traditional lot of cities. Thank you, Tony.